assignment behind enemy lines into the war zone. No. Commander Shepard, please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial yeah, Hospital. I know your stock of modified medicine. It's completely tasteless to call this place Huerta Memorial. No, you don't President Huerta died of a stroke two years ago, ma'am. I think you meant to say the man was dead for an hour and a half and his political enemies piled on enough propaganda to get the hospital name changed. He can't remember his own name without the VI in his head telling him what it is. Trust me, in this building, we know that. The Supreme Court says he's alive. Five justices say he's alive. Two of them appointed by him. The name is what it is. It's completely tasteless to call this place Fuerte. What's going on here? Ma'am, I'll cut you a deal. You buy us 90 million credits worth of life-saving equipment, and you can name the hospital whatever you want. Now the truth comes out. My job here is done. The council called the invaders Reapers. Welcome to Serta. Thank you for shopping. <clears throat> Commander Shepard. When I heard Earth was under attack, I tried to call. I never got through. Thane, good to see you staying in shape. My disease kills slowly. With enough care and a healthy lifestyle, it can be delayed for a few years. Of course, my allotted time has come and gone. Now I exercise because it pleases me. What are you doing here? Visiting a friend, Caden. He got hurt protecting me. The human biotic in intensive care. <coughs> I saw the marks of an implant. Yeah. We have spoken. He seems an honorable sort. Your enemies may try to finish him off here. I will look out for him. I appreciate it, Thane. I am near the end of my life. It is a good time to be generous. Keppel Syndrome has put most of my other plans on hold. Do you know how much time you have left? I've been to several doctors. My favorite gave me three months to live. Nine months ago. It's freeing to find no requirements placed on me. No responsibilities. No fears. It is a good end to a life. Are you in a lot of pain? At times. The oxygen transfer proteins don't form correctly. Your human equivalent would be hemoglobin. As a result, my blood is low in oxygen. No matter how much I breathe in, I get tingling, numbness, and that is the best of it. As for my brain, I cannot track the damage. I just experience dizziness from time to time. I'm back in the Normandy on an important mission. Sure could use you. I would not be as I was before. I need daily medical attention. And if I know you, you will want to fight the Reapers somehow. You need the best at your side. And I am not at mine. You don't have to wrestle down Krogan and break their necks. I'm sure we could find you lighter work. I am at peace with what I've done in my life, Shepard. There comes a time when one must rest from war and conflict. It is not your time, but it is mine. I wish the best for you, Thane. And I for you. Do not grieve for me. I have good doctors. My son visits regularly. Perhaps we will keep up via the extranet now that you are free. Until we meet again, Shepard. The Alliance military has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of Palamon. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. Shepard, there you are. Dr. Chakwas, you're here? I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Shouter Woods, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy, and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. 
We had a run-in with a Cerberus synthetic on Mars. Caden took the worst of it. How's he doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Major Elenko's resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. It's been six months, Doctor. How have you been? Good. I've been fortunate. When they impounded Normandy, the Alliance didn't really know what to do with me. I was never officially part of Cerberus, and I'd gotten a proper leave of absence from my previous post. So you hadn't technically done anything wrong by joining me to defeat the Collectors? Yes, though I suppose if you were judged to be a war criminal, I would have been tried as an accessory. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word and I'm with you. The Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D-24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Don't thank me so soon. Remember, Joker is still aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. Azari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Superior Navy Line. Commander Shepard, good to see you. Dr. Michelle, it's been a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I'm med physician in the Presidium Clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Major Alenko. How is Caden doing? Stable. There's no evidence of cognitive impairment from the concussion. But multiple shoulder fractures are still on the mend. Bed rest under observation is all that's needed now. I'm sure a visit would be welcomed. This war has left a lot of injured people homeless. How's your center handling the extra load? We're fine now, but I'm worried. Every hospital on the Citadel is preparing for the worst. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we just can't leave people floating out there forever. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. We've posted guards on our reserves. War profiteering has already begun. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. Ilium is under attack. Although the Asari colony is lost in the Yes, I'm trying to place a call to Grissom Academy. They have biotic amp interfaces. I may be able to adapt for Asari use. No, it won't connect. It says the station's communication system is offline. Of course. If these interfaces make our commandos better on the field, I'll hold for as long as you need. Listen to me, those prototypes are vital. We need these biotic upgrades to fight the Reapers. I know the Ismar frontier isn't safe. Yes, yes. You can replace the prototypes. Yes, but clone tissue replacement takes months. You'll need a prosthetic. Oh, no. I highly recommend talking to a resident psychiatrist before the operation. Azari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces. I'd like an answer, Major. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you, now more than ever. You'll have it soon, Counselor. I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard? Adina? Hey. Shepard, hey. You, you just missed snack time. Actually, that's probably a good thing. Thanks for coming. No problem. What did Adina want? Still thinking about the Spectre position? Oh, it was a big honor. A huge responsibility. Just need to be sure. I got you this. Wow, thanks, Shepard. That's really great. Just a little pick-me-up. Maybe when I'm out, we can crack it open and celebrate. I am so ready to get out of here, Shepard. You can't tell, but I'm tied to this bed by medical red tape. I'm in Doc. Doc says I'm good to go, but then she always finds just one more test to run. You doing okay? My implant got a little rattled, so Doc just wants me to keep the biotics offline for a bit. It's really no big deal. Need me to break you out? 
<laughs> I'll let you know. I'm glad you asked me to come. It's good to see you're gonna be okay. Thanks. You almost died on my watch. It was horrible to see. I want you to be straight with me then. So I just want to make sure, after Mars, after Horizon, you and me, we're good. We've been through hell together, at each other's backs. That kind of bond is hard to break. No, not just that. You were my commander, sure, but you listen, too. We went through Ash's death together. Yeah. We did. So what do you say? <sighs> Are we good? We're good. It was great to have you back on the Normandy. Thanks. Feel like we've cleared the air? Yeah, you know, I'm... I'm not sure that I've been wrong about Cerberus, but... I've been wrong about you. I should let you get back to the Normandy. Wish I could come with you. Take care of yourself, Caden. We need you at 100%. Will do. Thanks for coming. Something else, Shepard? Give me the update, Major. <laughs> Major, yeah. Congrats. There's obviously been a lot going on. Anderson asked me to take over a spec ops program. First Special Operations Biotics Division. We're recruiting the most talented human biotics from around the galaxy. What's the focus? Covert high-risk missions. Turn it down at first. I mean, teaching? <laughs> I prefer to get my hands dirty. Anderson can be pretty persuasive. Yeah. Bit of a hard ass, but you can't argue with his kind of experience. Wouldn't take no, said it had to be me. With your history, you're the perfect choice. True. Human biotics are... We're different. Freaks, even. Most people in the galaxy still see us that way. But accepting it, embracing it, can be the difference between success and sitting at home in your PJs taking red sand. You said your implant got rattled. Everything good? Uh, the medical gibberish was a bit more impressive, but that's what I took away. Rattled. Found a great doc at HQ that's fascinated by the L2 implant. Kind of her pet project. The headaches are as bad as ever, but she's, she's got me on a regimen of acupuncture and meds and some nasty tasting concoction. Won't tell me what it is. But my biotics are stronger than ever. Maybe some things get better with age. Or maybe you have. <laughs> are you flirting with me, Commander? Wait, wait. Don't tell me. Let me live in the illusion. You've been injured. Sure you want right back in the thick of it? Are you kidding? <sighs> I want to kick the Reapers straight to hell. Cerberus, too. People near death say their lives flash before their eyes. <sighs> well, the future flashed for me. The anguish, the, the families, the children. It made me determined to live. I need to do something, Shepard. To save at least a few lives. Are we going to be able to get past what happened on Horizon? I'd like to, Shepard. I'd like to move past the harsh words and be friends. At least. So how do we fix it? I'll admit, I own a lot of that. You were standing right in front of me and I was... I shut you down. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, so let's just put it behind us and get on with what's important right now. Bury it? Bury it. Forgive it. I... I think that's how we get past Horizon. Where's your family? Are they safe? My family? My parents live in Vancouver. But Dad's family owns an orchard in the BC interior. They were headed out there on a shuttle the day of the attack. Heard from them? No. Not yet. But I hope, I'm hoping Dad's Alliance training has kept them safe. Must be killing them not knowing where I am. I should probably get going. Thanks for coming by. Take care, Caden.